Hi, I'm Brad and today we are going to learn about how to create a sticky column in Elementor. And this is the effect like we have we are going to create and this column will be sticky scrolling. So how to create the sticky column on scroll. So let's create a simple page and go to pages. Upload this page. Add it with Elementor. Okay, now we are going to create the two columns. The one column which will scroll while we scroll the page, and the other column will be sticky when we are scrolling the page. So let's just create the two columns and this column will be scrollable and this will be sticky let's make this column which you want to be a sticky okay so what you have to do is we have to give these both columns this column and this the classes so first of all for this column we have to give a class like this is the class elementor section wrapper so we will go to advanced tab Click on this column, you will go to advanced tab and once in classes, we put the class here, the elemental section wrap. Okay. Now this column, we have to give uh, this column also a class to this column. So the name of the class this column is okay. Let's click on this. We go to advanced tab. Here's the classes, paste the class here. Okay, now these both are two columns, this column and this column, and we want this column to be sticky when we are scrolling this column and its content will be sticky. So let's just add some content here to be sticky when we scroll this. Okay, I'm going to just copy the content from here. Okay, copy this content, paste in here, and paste. Okay, now copy this okay paste over here and let's just copy this form and paste in here okay so now we want this column to be sticky you will have to have inner section to be this column to be sticky Okay, let's just maybe we have the intersection and we'll delete this column. Let's just pick this up and put it in the section because we want this uh, section to be sticky. So uh, the sticky section has to be an intersection and we will give a clause to an intersection, a sticky clause to an intersection. So the clause would be the sticky column. Okay, the sticky column we go here in advanced tab. We will go to CSS classes and we put a sticky column as a class this section. Now, so nothing is sticky, we haven't added any CSS to these classes. So let's just add the CSS and then we will see the effect. Okay, with the CSS, I already made this is so this is a very simple CSS okay so where we have to the CSS we can go to the page settings and then advanced and advanced we have the CSS section and we can paste the CSS here okay so these are already the, uh, the uh, classes we have assigned to our sections so then there is some simple CSS given to be a sticky and that's it let's just test our column is sticky or not okay now i'm scrolling and you will see that this column is sticky on its place and it's not going over this area means the column is only sticky in its proportions it not, will not overlap the extra content which throughout the whole page it just it will just go uh, in its column proportions Okay guys, that's it. It's very simple. 
CSS. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. Thank you so much.